with the friends. I mean, we continue the same relationship, and you know, I became Formula One driver. It's part of this life. If you can't deal with it, then you do something else. Now we are quite famous, so can you still have a normal life, a normal relationship with people around you, with friends? Um, or how has your life changed in the last year since you became a Formula One driver? It does change. Um, a lot, you know, good way, a lot of good way, good things uh, went, but, you know, a couple of things that I felt a little bit worse. But most of the things I felt good, of course. With the friends, I mean, we continue the same relationship, you know, I became Formula One driver. I'm lucky that I've managed to keep all my friends from, you know, my hometown and met a lot of, uh, a lot of good people. So I'm, I'm extremely lucky in that sense that I'm surrounded by, like, really, really good friends. Uh, and it's something which is important to me because that's also my way to disconnect from this crazy world which is the F1 world. They don't act me or they don't treat me like a Formula 1 driver, just as a person. So, yeah, just uh, with a friend, it's not just normal. It's almost as a previous years, before, even before I became Formula 1 driver, which will help me a lot and also which I'm really happy with that, uh, with that relationship because I can be always honest and um, open myself a lot um, outside of the Formula One, um, which feels always me re relax and help my also mentality as well, yeah. You know, I, I need this balance in my life where I can just go from track to track and then after go off somewhere with my friends, enjoy life, because it's also about enjoying this you know, every moment and enjoying experiences and that's something which is really important. That's how I kind of energize myself and get back even more focused um, to the next race. So it's not easy, obviously, and also because people recognize you more and more, but it's part of this life. If you can't deal with it, then you do something else. You know, it's, I think it's a small, I would not even call it disadvantage, but um, you know, it's, you gotta cope with it and I'm kind of cool with it because people are nice. You know, it's not like they come to me to fight me or, or with a negative vibe, like it's most of the time for picture, autograph. So it's, uh, it's also like a nice gesture or attention. So it's, uh, I'm cool with that.